Hi, I'm Amy Simons, a public health nurse with the Fairfax County Health Department, and today we are broadcasting from the beautiful Country Club of Fairfax in honor of Nurses Week, celebrating the work of public health nurses. The health department employs 190 nurses who work in communicable disease, homeless health care, direct patient care, adult day health care centers, maternal child health home visiting, as well as school health. And joining me today is Jessica Ong, who is a nurse liaison for the Federally Qualified Health Center Community Health Care Network of Fairfax County. Jessica was just named Nurse of the Year by the Fairfax County Health Department, and congratulations, Jessica. Can you tell us what you do for the health department? Thank you, Amy. Um, I work in the Chronic Disease Care Coordination Program within our community clinics. And what I do is I work with patients one-on-one -on -one in their homes um, and we help manage chronic diseases such as diabetes, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, and sometimes a mix of all those. My goal is to empower people to make their own health decisions and own health goals because I want to show that health decisions aren't just made in your doctor's office or in the hospital by your nurse or your phys physician. Mm -hmm. It starts with you. Um, and in these hopes, we hope that healthy choices will continue after they've graduated from our program and continue to influence their families, their schools, and communities. Thanks for that great work that you do in making a difference. Can you share with us how helping residents manage those chronic illnesses and chronic diseases directly impacts the health of our community as a whole? Yeah, that's a great question. Um, CDC estimates that 50% of the American population suffer from one or more chronic diseases. So. In those words, um, half the population would benefit from chronic disease programs such as our own. And as for the other half who do not have chronic diseases, um, it's important to keep in mind that people with chronic diseases aren't siloed on their own. They are our neighbors, our families, people who serve and work in our community. So any day that is lost um, due to sick leave or, um, or if you're taking care or acting as a caregiver for another, that is productivity that is lost to our community. And um, even though we work one-on-one -on -one with patients, we devise strategies to make healthy choices the default. And we do our best to extrapolate these strategies to the larger population so we can prevent chronic disease before it starts and also um, be able to apply it to our community. Fabulous. The theme for uh, Nurses Week this year is four million reasons to celebrate. And in recognition of the vast contributions and positive impact of the four million registered nur nurses. What are some of the positive impacts that public health nursing has in our own Fairfax County community? First, I want to acknowledge all the nurses who have the heart and power to improve people's health and better their lives. Thank you. Um, I've been lucky enough to witness firsthand the public health responses here in Fairfax County, and I've noticed that public health has a unique insight. We treat individuals one-on-one, -on -one, but we can also target prevention strategies. We touch and see people in their lives when they're healthy and when they're sick. So we can detect trends and patterns to piece together a bigger picture of what's going on in our community. And from this big picture, we can shape our policies, our programs to further protect everyone in our community. Great work. And I like yeah. to focus on the prevention as well. <laughs> so earlier today, you were recognized uh, as Fairfax County's Health Department Nurse of the Year. Again, congratulations. And how does it feel to have this honor? I feel incredibly honored and humbled, and it's a privilege to be interviewed by you, Amy, our previous recipient of Nurse of the Year. And I feel very lucky to be working in Fairfax County, where we are constantly reevaluating our standards to keep up with the latest evidence-based practice. I know we have a lot more work to do, but knowing that my colleagues are striving to make Fairfax a better place to live, to work, to play, makes it all worthwhile. Thank you, Jessica. And again, congratulations, Thank huge you. congratulations. The health department is honored to recognize your individual work and the work of all the nurses that make an impact and ensure the health of our community. If you would like more information about what nurses do for the health department, please go to www.fairfaxcounty.gov backslash health. And thank you for joining in. If you have any questions or comments, please use the comment section below. And if you would like to recognize a nurse who's made a difference, please do tell us about it. Thanks for tuning in today, and we'll see you next time.